So to create an online register for your class, if you go to the add-on menu and click select class, it should bring up a sidebar that shows all of the classes in which you are a teacher. So I'm gonna select demo class and click create online register. And you may notice in the bottom, it's creating a new sheet for my demo class. It's pulling in my demo students and it's um, automatically creating all of the register. Then it gives you an option. Do you want to post that to your classroom as a material? So I'm gonna click yes and it's sending that now to my Google, my demo class um, as a Google form that they can fill in each day. Uh, and then you can close that sidebar when it's done. And now when I go to my demo class, this is what it looks like. Um, so it's in the stream, but it would also be uh, in classwork. And this is a material. So this is what students would see as well. And when they click it, it will open up the form, which is just a one button click to, to show that they have registered. So now I've actually logged in as one of my demo users. Um, so here, this is demo user 12. Um, and as you can see, when I click submit, if you look over on the left, it will tick off that user and the time that they registered. Um, and that, that form will always stay the same. So you don't need to post a new form every day. You only need to do that once. Um, just get the students to, to click it. Uh, the weeks are collapsible, so if you want to hide them when they're finished or, or reduce them so you can see other weeks more easily, you can do that and you can delete columns um, for certain days you don't need. If you want to add another week, there's another function called add another week, which does what it says. So it just creates a new week, deletes the Saturday and Sunday um, and groups it as well. And if you didn't post it to Google Classroom, if you'd rather maybe embed the form on a website perhaps, then you can get the link, it would be in cell B1, um, and you can just copy that to your clipboard and uh, share that with your students however you interact with them. So we hope this will be useful, like it was at our schools, and thanks for watching.